numerals, cardinal and ordinal, fractional, time, much, many, a little, a few, a lot, plenty. The cardinal numbers 1, 2, 3, etc. are adjectives referring to quantity and the ordinal numbers 1st, 2nd, 3rd, etc. refer to distribution. Cardinal 1. Ordinal 1st 2. 2nd 3. 3rd 4 fourths, 5 fifths, 6 sixths, 7 sevenths, 8 eighths, 9 ninths, 10 tenths, 11 elevenths, 12 twelfths, 13 thirteenths, 14 fourteenths, 15 fifteenths, 16 sixteenths, Seventeen seventeenths, eighteen eighteenths, nineteen nineteenths, twenty twenties, thirty thirties, thirty one, thirty first, forty forties, fifty fifties, sixty sixties, seventy seventies, eighty eighties, ninety nineties. One hundred hundreds, five hundred, five hundreds, one thousand thousands, one thousand five hundred, or fifteen hundred, one thousand five hundreds, one hundred thousand, hundred thousands, one million. Note. We use cardinal hundred with s plus of plus plural noun, implying indefinite number. For example, hundreds of people, but hundred people, definite number. Fractions and decimals. We use ordinal numbers at the end position to talk about Fractions a half, a third, two third, a quarter or a fourth, three hundred, three fourths, a fifth, two fifths, a sixth, five sixths, a seventh, an eighth, a tenth, seven tenths, a twentieth. Forty seven hundreds, a hundreds, a thousands. Notice that one fourth, you can say a quarter or a fourth. If we have a whole number with a fraction, we use the word and between the two parts. For example, two and three fifths. For parts of whole numbers, we use decimal point. Not a comma. For example, two and a half, two point five. If there is a more than one number after a decimal point, we say each number individually. For example, three thousand four hundred and fifty six point seven eight nine. The exception to this rule is when we are talking about dollars or cents or pound and pence. For example, twenty-one dollars, ninety-five cents. Saying the word cents at the end is optimal. What's the time in English? Explanation. There are two common ways of telling the time. Formal but easier way. Say the hours first and then the minutes. Example 7.45 For minutes 01 through 09 you can pronounce as O 
Example. 1106. More popular way. Say the minutes first and then the hours. Use past and the preceding hour for minutes 01 through 30. Use to and the forthcoming hour for minutes 31 through 59. But, example, 15 minutes past 7, 15 minutes to 8. Another possibility of saying 15 minutes past is a quarter past. Another possibility of saying 15 minutes to is a quarter to. Another possibility of saying 30 minutes past is half past. Example, half past five. Note, use a clock only at the full hour. Example, seven o'clock, but ten past seven. In English ordinary speech, the twelve hour clock is used. Example, 20 past 5. For times around midnight or midday, you can use the expression midnight or midday, noon, instead of the number 12. Example, double o hundred, midnight, 1200, midday or noon. To make clear, where necessary, whether you mean a time before 12 o'clock, noon or after, you can use in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, at night. Use in the morning before 12 o'clock noon. After 12 o'clock noon, use in the afternoon. When to change from afternoon to evening, from evening to night, and from night to morning, depends on your sense of time. Example, 3.15, a quarter past three in the morning, or a quarter past three at night. More formal expression to indicate whether time is before noon or after, a.m. and p.m. Also, a.m. ante meridian, before noon, p.m. post meridian, afternoon. Use this expression only with a formal way of telling the time. Example, 3.15, 3.15 a.m. It's not usual to use a.m. and p.m. with past two. Example, 3.15, 15 minutes past or a quarter past three. American English. Beside past, Americans often use after. Example, 0610, 10 past or after 6. But in time expression with half past, it's not usual to replace past by after. Beside to, Americans often use before, of or till. Example, 0550. 10 to, before, of, or till 6. Many, much, a little, little, a few, few. When do we use much and when many? Much, uncountable nouns. Milk, marmalade, money, time, etc. Many, countable nouns. Bottles of milk. Jars of marmalade, dollars, minutes, etc. Examples. How much money have you got? How many dollars have you got? In informal English, these questions are often answered with a lot of, lots of. There is no much difference between the two phrases. 2. When do we use a little, little, and when a few, few? A little, non-countable nouns. Milk, marmalade, money, time, etc. 
a few countable nouns bottles of milk jars of marmalade dollars minutes examples he has a little money left he has a few dollars left few is a negative idea it means almost none we can also use very few i am very sad i have few good friends i am very sad i have very few good friends both these sentences mean i don't have many good friends i would like to have more little is a negative idea it means nearly none nearly nothing we can also use very little i can't help you i speak little english i can't help you i speak very little english both these sentences mean my english isn't good i would like to speak english better a lot of lots of when do we use a lot of and when lots of these phrases are mainly used in informal english lots of sounds a bit more informal than a lot of both forms are used in singular and in plural sentences it's not the phrase a lot of or lots of which determines singular or plural but the subject of the sentence here water and computers one informal english singular a lot of water is wasted lots of water is wasted plural a lot of computers are needed at schools lots of computers are needed at schools two formal english in formal english we use plenty of or much and many instead of a lot of lots of singular plenty of water is wasted much water is wasted plural plenty of computers are needed at schools many computers are needed at schools let's have some trial test now you have to choose right answer my son's birthday is on a 6 november b on the 6th of november c november of 6 d the 6th november e 6th of november